I remember I'm sitting there because the door would always be open. I wouldn't have my car running, but I would just be sitting there smoking, smoking. As I'm sitting there, I don't know what came over me, but I don't know if it was because I smoked so many in one sitting when I was sitting there. Mm. But it was, I said a prayer, but it wasn't really a prayer. It was like an exclaim. Like I just let out a sigh of like, just, I was exhausted of it. I, I literally sat there. I, I looked at the cigarette and I'm looking at it. And I'm just like, God, free me from this. Like I, I can't even do it the way that I did it. Yeah. But it was like out loud, verbally, like I was just done. Like I was so done with smoking. I was just like, yo, free me from this, please. Like I'm tired of smoking these. That's mm-hmm. what I said. And I threw the cigarette down, and I I, I swear immediately mm. I, I I can't I can't equate it to anything. Like it, if you smoke cigarettes, you know the feeling of having to smoke cigarettes. Yeah. But I it literally and and I'm gonna sound like I'm being mm. like I'm being theatrical. No, or just like, you share what you got to like share. Like the metaphor is too similar to what deliverance is. Mm-hmm. But I it felt like I had shackles on mm-hmm. me. I felt like I had chains on me. It felt like I had a collar around my neck not while i'm smoking i'm saying like in the moment in that moment i realized what it was like this is what i'm equating to what it felt like it Uh felt like suddenly i felt these things just break like i just felt it fall off Uh of me like i literally i'm like i don't have to smoke anymore like i just knew 